Uh oh. Huh? Hmm? Something is shining over there. The lair of the Queen Gibdo? Okay, let's let's anticipate how this battle's going to go. First and foremost. Oh, that's cool. We're going to have to destroy these pillars as Gibdo spawn to let light into the room. And then, at some point, somehow, I'm going to have to reflect said light back at the Queen Gibdo. So, let's check to see. I know I'm getting a little bit ahead of myself here. Do I have a mirror? I, I have a light. I don't think that's really what I need. I don't think that's bright enough. So, I have my mirror shield. That's going to have to suffice. Okay. And we can't kill these right now. We're going to have to target that first, which will tr trigger the Queen Gibdo. Uh, I know this is dumb, but just in the sake of protecting myself, uh, I don't think I need the glow, but I don't really have a better alternative. I guess this is what I'm doing. This is, this is the, this is my gear. But, what I really wanted to do is heal up a quarter heart because that's going to protect me from an insta-kill. Yeah. All right. We ready? Let's do it. Boss time. You know, I, I expressed confusion at the design of the Gibdo, but ultimately these are these aren't Gibdos. Let's go. We'll finish it off here and now. There's something else, and just Gibdo is the name they chose. We've got it cornered here. Do we have it cornered? I don't think we have it cornered. What is that? What is that? Take cover. <laughs> Ow, that hurt, but not too bad. Shoot. Wow, I nailed that. It's vulnerable. We do have Gibdo bones. And I would like my best bow. How did that miss? Watch for the tornado. Yeah, I'm watching it. I'm watching it and having difficulty running from it. Get it? That's good damage. Turn. It's amazing how difficult it is to hit this thing, considering its size. It's doing a good job at playing to its outs. Come on, uh, get my best. Is this my best weapon? I kind of like the quick charge. It's weakening. Yeah, it is. Oh. It got its vulnerability again! Ow! That, uh... Wasn't exactly how I wanted that to go down. We do have attack up food, though. We have actual attack up food. And now I'm ready for it. Riju, where are you? Get it! Ho oh, ho! Oh. That was... That was clutch. Where'd you go? Where, where? Where? Oh, there you are. There you are. Run. Great damage. But here's the thing. It is yet to use the hives. So this fight is about to get a lot more difficult. All right. Yeah. Thankfully, oh, they're flying too. I forgot about them. Late. Can't do it. Ow. Uh, let's use this. I kind of didn't want to use Riju's attack. Equip a different weapon. Equip a different weapon. Quick, quick, quick. I probably should have done some fusing. And switch. Put him down. Block that. Good, make them all vulnerable. There is an attack incoming. Hopefully that doesn't insta-kill me. 
Oh, I dodged it. Okay, you're dead. You both are dead. Uh, let's... Blame you. That hurt. Yeah, I'm trying. They just keep coming. Yeah, they do. Come on. Spread your wings. Go. Okay. Good, 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 good. This is a lot to deal with. Uh, and I really didn't prepare for this in terms of my fusions terribly well. Okay, they can, they can do that. Um, man. You're dead. Run. Heal just a little bit. Riju. Riju, I need you. Oh, let's kill that first. Good job. And I don't... And this isn't even dealing with the Queen Gibdo. Um, oh, I need to stay in the light. I need to stay in the light. Staying in the light is going to help me a lot. Go. Heal again. Okay, the light is definitely helping me right now. Where is, where is she? Where is she? There she is, there she is. Okay. Uh, yeah, this is really good for us. Reminds me a lot of, uh, it reminds me a lot of the Earth Temple. Whoa! What if it's killed me? I'm not doing terribly well. I'm alive, but only through the, the graces of, yeah. Only through the graces of insta-kill protection, which is not a great place to be. Come on. Riju, I need your lightning. This is great damage. I might might be able to kill him. I need to get out of the way. No. Really? Oh, oh no. I saw him. Whoa. I haven't been hit by those point blank yet. I don't think you can flurry rush them. Get ready. Go. Great timing. Where are you going? Where are you going? Next phase. Next phase. Good job. Okay. I almost feel like I don't need to skip any of that out because that, that was... I speed ran that. Okay. Priority one. We're gonna get overwhelmed unless we we find some light. So Riju, charge up quick. Charge up. Don't get hit. Come on, Riju. Ignore these for now. Deal with that. And get in the light. Get in the light. Yeah. Okay. That's that's where we need to be. Yep. They're going to still be able to hit us with projectiles. But, we can fire back. This is all good. I really want to deal with the ones that can do ranged attacks, because I'm going to be basically invulnerable for, from all others. Where's the attack coming from? Over there. Okay. Thankfully, I can see it. Take out your shield link. Okay. Riju. Riju. I need you to start charging up. We're going to heal. Not going to make that mistake again. Where is she? She's there. All right. You guys. For a second, I thought I'd die for some reason because of the freeze frame. You're doing that. You're doing that. And Riju, you should be able to... What? Okay, we're, do we're doing good. We're, we're kind of in a, a good spot here. We're burning them. Riju, start your attack. I almost wonder... You know what? I, I will target him. Fuse attack power. Go, 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 go. Got him. Just get the hits that I can. He's gonna do the cyclone. Come on. Ah, can't get to him in time. This might be able to reach him. That's decent damage-ish. Got his attention. Let's stun him. Are you okay? 
I'm fine. It do, it's just wind. Doesn't deal that much damage. Perfect. Can I kill him with this? I think I can. I did. Ha! <laughs> what a hectic boss fight. I wanted to do it again. If only because I feel like it was it was messy. There's so much going on. I I don't think I've ever fought a boss like that. I think the closest is like Phantom Zant. It was that was wild. And there are so many different routes I could have gone with it. I could have focused down the hives. I could have done what I did and just went for him and decided to make that, that call. There, There's a myriad of ways that could have gone. And for that, all the Gibdos are dead. We get a, a heart container, which honestly is kind of needed. Um, man, that's, I don't, you know what? Now that I think about it, I don't think I've ever died in a boss fight before. I don't, I don't think I did. Like in the history of the channel, I don't think I've ever died in a boss fight. <sighs> For that, you know, I probably don't need to climb this. I can probably just like walk up to it and press A. No, I need to climb it. Kind of, maybe. Or I can. <laughs> don't don't mind me, Riju. It's it's okay. Everything is under control. Apparently, I need to climb it very messily. Wait, what? I can't. Hold up. What? What? A, what? What? <laughs> um. Let's let's talk to Riju. <laughs> That's what. Okay. All right. <laughs> don't mind me. I was born yesterday. <laughs> yes, it's an amber relic. It's worth 50 rupees. You now are 50 rupees richer. And blind. <laughs> Read you, beloved daughter of the Gerudo. I know that voice. You are the one who's been talking all this time. Yes, your ancestor from a time long past. I was a Gerudo warrior who served the first king of Hyrule and a sage who called down lightning, just as you can. I've seen you brandish the power you have in defense of our people. I would expect nothing less from my descendant. You are the pride of the Gerudo. The Demon King is responsible for sending the monster that caused the Sand Shroud. But the monster's true purpose was to prevent you from obtaining that stone. My secret stone. Demon King? Secret stone? <laughs> Don't worry. You will understand soon enough. Let me tell you of events in our distant past. The events that shaped our people's destiny during the imprisoning war. Long, long ago, when the kingdom of Hyrule was still young, a great evil, the Demon King, emerged. He attacked the innocent and sought the destruction of Hyrule. He was our chief before he changed. His obsession with power transformed him into a monster. Raru, the first king of Hyrule, and six warriors rose to oppose him. I'm proud to have been one of them. We faced the Demon King, but only after Raru gave us the means to fight the monster. Secret stones, artifacts that amplified the abilities of those who carried them. I, the Sage of Lightning, fought by my fellow sages in battle with my own secret stone. But we were no match for his overwhelming power. He endured our strongest attacks, 
Even the lightning strikes I called down. King Raru knew we had lost the battle against the Demon King. He made the ultimate sacrifice to imprison the Demon King, to seal him away. That was the imprisoning war. The rest of us survived that historic battle. Not long after, a visitor came to me, and she set the Gerudo on our destined path. Another of the six sages, the Sage of Time. The magic restraining the Demon King will eventually be undone. When that time comes, you must help Link. He is a noble swordsman who will fight that monster. So please, he will need your assistance. Lend him your power, the Gerudo's control of lightning. The path of the Gerudo was clear at that moment. We wish nothing more than to eliminate the Demon King. We are responsible for his very existence in this world, and for that we must make amends. I swear to you that when the Demon King returns, the Gerudo Sage of Lightning will awaken once more. The Gerudo Sage and her people will fight alongside your swordsmen. And now I have told you all I can of the Imprisoning War and of our people's destiny. You have saved Gerudo Town. But the Demon King still remains a threat. Riju, daughter of the Gerudo. You must take up my secret stone and honor the vow I made to the Sage of Time long ago. Fight alongside the Swordsman, Link. So it's my destiny to fight by your side. <sighs> my destiny as a sage, my duties as chief, and fighting side by side with you? <laughs> Sounds like fun. I will gladly strike down the so-called Demon King. I guess it's time to claim my destiny! Bosa had that same earring. <laughs> Link's like, ha! <laughs> Link, <laughs> I've been there, I've done that. <laughs> Link has never shaken anyone's hand before. <laughs> it's very I new to him. The Sage of Lightning, swear that I will stand with you. And here, as proof of my vow. Oh. We have a new art. Lightning? Maybe? Is that what's happening? Lightning. Use that ring to call upon my power whenever you need it. <laughs> it seems I can finally repay you. Okay, should we head back to town? Trudeau. 
I've received reports that ever since the Sand Shroud dissipa dissipated, Gibdo attacks have almost completely entirely stopped. Oh. It will no doubt take some time to rebuild, but it is thanks to your help that we can live on the surface again. On behalf of all the Gerudo people, thank you. I am sorry to say, though, that despite the safety of the Gerudo town no longer being a pressing concern, we still haven't been able to uncover any information on the whereabouts of Princess Zelda. Hmm. Actually, Boriara, I do have a small piece of information regarding Zelda. I experienced a vision when I took the secret stone in my hand. The person that my ancestor referred to as the Sage of Time looked identical to Zelda. But it'd be impossible for that person to be Zelda, wouldn't wouldn't it? Hmm. Hmm. My ancestor claimed to have been from the distant past. It's just not possible for Zelda to be in that era. Hmm. hmm. Pay me no mind. I'm just thinking out loud. Hmm. I'm sorry, Link. Although the threat of the Sand Shroud and the Gibdos has passed, I cannot leave Gerudo Town at the moment. Things need some time to settle. However... We will take on the task of searching this area for any signs of Zelda. Hmm. And with my newfound power as a sage, I will still be able to support you. I swear I will do anything I can to help. Vow of Riju, the Sage of Lightning. Proof of the Vow of Riju, the Sage of Lightning. Use it to su summon or dismiss the Avatar of Riju. That was a lot of Rijus, a lot of Sages of Lightning in that <laughs> those two sentences. I hope your travels bring you back here again, Link. I look forward to such a reunion. And I... Oh, pfft, everyone... Okay, bye. <laughs> bye, everybody. And I, as the Sage of Light... No, seriously, look at my clothing. I, I kind of matched the ancient Sage of Lightning. I have some thoughts on, on that whole thing that I'd like to get out while the thoughts are still fresh. <laughs> Is Ocarina of Time retconned? Can Zelda travel through time? What? What? What is hap- Give me all these. Thank you. Dope. What What was happening with all of that? I have so many questions I, I want answered. And unfortunately, I'm at the end of a recording session, so I can't find out. However, what? How do we use... How do we use this power? Okay. How do I use this power? Um. Special controls. The backflip. That's new. That's not what I want. Um. No. Did I just gloss over how to use it? Hold up, let me... Let me, let me talk to it. Read you, read you. In your child's booster seat, talk to me. I will do my best to learn what is happening with Zelda before we meet again. Make sure to come back and visit. Oh, and don't forget. Even when I cannot be by your side, I, I, you can always call in my power as a sage. But how? What am I... What am I missing? Um... Maybe, wait, maybe I need to, like, target somebody. Maybe that's it. No. No. How? It doesn't work how it did in, um, in Breath of the Wild. I would think they would explain it to me. They just said? They just, like, said that I can, not how. Unless I completely glossed over that. What? Okay, let's dismiss it real quick. Nothing's changed. Let's enable it. Maybe I need to find an enemy. Enemy! Oh, maybe... Maybe I just need to leave! Okay! Oh, that's that's literally it. 
Regis Val has granted you power to summon her avatar. And so I have it. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, we, we got there. So while I am out and about, I basically have Riju with me at all times. Neat. All right. Uh, that that made a lot more sense. I just had to walk. It's weird to me that they didn't just explain that, but I I I got nothing. I actually got nothing. Also, didn't they say behind the throne was something like a hole? What? Why can't I interact with this? What? Why is this interactive? I'd... Huh. That's... I can't dive, at least not yet. Maybe they give me the power to dive? That's really odd. They mentioned the hole behind the throne being closed. And the water... Wait, is that sealed now? Hold up. Can I not go back there? No, I can. Uh, that would have been a shame if they just... They just sealed off this architecture. That's odd, though, that that's like that. Huh. Also, this is clearly the place I can go. And something I can read! Or not. Okay. Uh, you know, I, I'm kind of, I'm kind of aimless right now. Let's, let's actually, let's actually tie this into a neat little bow here. That's gonna be the end of this recording session. That was, what a wild adventure, a wild arc that was. But it's not over. I, uh, I would like to remain in Gerudo for a little bit longer. I mean, probably, that's the thing. I, we could, comp like, we can move on, but we can also complete, like, complete some of the shrines that are here. And there's so much more to do. It, this game, is it feels much, much bigger than Breath of the Wild, but not in, in like, expanse, although there's that too, but just in content. I mean, we now have the ghost of Riju that we can summon and have it fight alongside us, so that we went through an entire dungeon with uh, two boss fights, technically, three boss fights, technically, three encounters, three story-based encounters, and that's, that's awesome. We had an entire dungeon to comb through, I didn't actually mean to do that. That was immediate. Did I just like... That was weird. How did I pull that out so quickly? Um, weird. The, there was so much there, and uh, the story is, is happening. Like, the, the, the world feels alive. And we have the license to move on, but I don't think we will. For one, we haven't even gotten the tower. I think that's probably going to be the content of next episode, is getting the tower, and then... We can start actually exploring and talking to these people. Wait, are you a woman? Are you a dude? Yeah, we're gonna be we're gonna be talking to some people next episode. We're gonna be exploring, unlocking stuff. The overworld is here. The or I'm not going to be beelining it back for the depths for quite some time. I kind of got my fill of that, but now it's time for us to kind of be unbridled and explore this place. It felt too... I, I felt pressure, like there was imminent danger, and honestly, I probably made the desert a lot safer by by handling the story now as opposed to waiting. So that's what we're going to be doing next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, next episode, I have no idea when it's going to come. Uh, I... There, there is a chance that this recording session will be, like, the last recording session for quite some time. Not only because I've been recording for over two hours, but also because I, I'm i getting surgery on my hand, which I'll probably be talking about in some of the Pikmin videos, just because I didn't find a good spot to talk about it here. Uh, but suffice to say, I'm getting some surgery on my hand, and I might be out for a while. We're going to find out. I might not be out at all, but there is a chance. All right. Uh, whew, I don't even know how to cap that off. That that was crazy. I Loved it though. That that I I'm start I'm actually kind of hooked on Tears of the Kingdom now. See you next time, I guess. Where I hopefully take a few photos because I didn't do that again. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>